We are Craigmount. We have been working with the young people to look at the diverse nature of our school in relation to ethnicity, gender, religion and other characteristics and now want to share some of this information we have gathered. The school role is rising and we will continue to rise. The background of the young people we have in front of us is also changing. We need to be aware of these changes to allow us to meet the needs of all young people and continue to develop a school community. Of the 1,316 pupils currently on roll, 52.5% are boys. This is different to the City of Edinburgh average, where 51.2% of the population are women. 82.5% of young people have English spoken as a home language. When we say home language, we mean native language, mother tongue or first language. This should be interesting as it means that 17.5% of young people do not have English as their home language. For young people at school, language can prove a barrier to learning but could also help us. Remarkably, there are actually 43 different languages spoken within Craigmount. The majority of our young people class themselves as white Scottish. In fact, 81.5% class themselves as white from any country. 18.5% identify themselves as Asian, black or other, meaning they have family roots in places like Bangladesh, China, India, Pakistan and the Caribbean, amongst others. Of the 1,316 pupils currently on roll, 809 have no recognised learning need, meaning that 507 young people do. This means that 38.5% of any class may have a learning need. We all need to work together to meet those needs. We are lucky as we have a lot of support to meet these learning needs. Having said that, the vast majority are met by teaching staff within a school. Where we feel these needs are not being met, we will engage support from the additional support for learning team, social work and partner agencies like Youth Agency. The Scottish Government allows all children in P1 to P5 to receive a free school meal. At secondary school, parents and carers must apply for these. Families will be entitled to free meals based upon household income, but will also cover young people who have been looked after or in kinship care. The take-up is about 20% nationally. To build a sense of community and belonging, we need to use the good work undertaken by primary schools to allow young people to find their place in the big school. We have young people joining us from the feeder primary schools, as well as 14 other schools. This results in many young people not knowing each other when they arrive. It also means travelling from further afield than previous generations. We are a school represented by many religions but where the majority of young people say they are atheists or have no religion. This is in line with city average. Christianity is the largest religious group, 6% of people follow Islam. We use class charts to look at behaviours in school. We find that the positive referrals are weighted more favourably towards boys and girls, although there isn't too much of a difference. When we look at the negative referrals, we see that there are about four times as many negative referrals given to males as females. School is a place where the majority of young people feel safe and confident enough to find out who they are. 70% of students said they were heterosexual, with 10% saying they were lesbian or gay. About 10% of young people say that they preferred not to say their sexuality. The remaining 10% answered with asexual, straight or other variants of sexualities. By looking at this data, we hope to continue to build a sense of community where everyone feels that their voice is heard. We want to bring out the best in everyone, whilst recognising that many young people need help with this. If 60% of young people say they have experienced bullying behaviour, we need to listen to them and take action. We need to be the role models. We need to challenge negative behaviour. We need to set the tone. If we want the young people to be safe, we need to encourage them to make good choices. We need to be ensured that everyone knows our systems and feel comfortable talking to any of us about incidents. Let's work together to develop this culture. Let's support each other. Let's be the best we can be. 
Let's develop trusting relationships. We are Craigmind.